How bad could it be to open a spade? I mean, what's gonna go wrong? <laughs> pass, pass. We are 5-5. Five, five. Let's open a heart. Partner bids a no trump. We should bid two diamonds. Partner invites us in diamonds. Woo. That's an exciting bid. Uh, well, we have options. I mean, we could pass. I think that's a little bit cowardly, though. Just because partner's a pass past hand, we have 14. We don't really have the values for game. I mean, I know the robots will tend to have like 11 high card points for these invites, hands that they should have opened, but we could bid three hearts. I'm, I'm tempted by the three heart bid because I think four hearts might be a sensible game contract to end up in. Like, 3 no kind of requires partner to have the diamond ace and, and either the heart finesse working or partner also has the heart queen. Otherwise, we're going to have a hard time, like, setting up tricks, I think, before the opponents get their black suit tricks in. Whereas in hearts, you know, if partner has the spade ace, we could win, take a heart finesse losing, rough the spade return, pull trumps, and then run all the diamonds. Whereas in no trump, we take that heart finesse that loses and the opponent's cash spades. Or maybe we could end up like pitching losers on losers in the club suit, depending on what partner spade holding is. I think I like looking for a 4-2 fit. I mean, if, if, if there was a way to convince partner to bid a doubleton heart at some point, I might not try three hearts myself, but with this partner, I think I'm just gonna bid three hearts. All right, well. Uncertain how well this is gonna do. <laughs> this, is, this is very uncertain because in no trump, I mean, presumably we're gonna do better playing in hearts. But it's easily possible that the opponents could give up a black suit trick and no trump, and we end up taking um, 10 tricks there as well. But I think I'm happy with the way things have gone. Let's play low just in case East roughs this trick. <laughs> uh... Okay, well, that's great. We've done God's work. West couldn't do anything other than lead my side diamond suit with Jack 10 fourth. Oh no. And another diamond rough. <laughs> it's just, it's just not possible. Holy cow. Um, I mean, I guess I can run the heart suit, see if they discard their, um, ace of clubs or king of clubs, whichever one's still out that I've forgotten about, but oh my. Looks like they did not. Gross. So gross. Unfortunately, even if they didn't lead the Jack of Diamonds, given that I have a Diamond Loser, I was still going down in four hearts. Yeah, this is horrible. The Ten of Spades is on side, so three no trump is going to play fine. I mean, it's not going to be minus 150. That's so sad. All right, next hand. The opponents have bid to three no after Stamen auction. No four card major. In West, partner leads the King of Hearts, which holds, 
and switches to the two of diamonds. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Um... Partner, why are we helping Declare by setting up the heart? Was that absolutely necessary? Probably not. There's a spade pitch. Okay. Looks like Declare is just cashing out. Made for. Four thirty. Hmm. I guess Declare always had these tricks. The spade pitch didn't really help them because they have a spade finesse. Okay, board three. Do we open? Hmm. I guess not. Partner opens a no trump. Hmm. Thoughts on bidding stamen? <laughs> I don't think I can bid stamen and then bid two spades and treat that as like an invite with five spades. I feel like that means something else to the robots, but I'm not. So yeah, yeah, stamen and then two spades shows four spades invitational. Like, why? I mean, why would it be necessary for us to have a four-card invite when partner, when partner doesn't have a fit? I guess I'll just transfer and drop it. Hello. East, vulnerable, has decided to come into this auction. I mean, I don't have great defense. But they are at the three level. Three clubs, pass, pass. Well, partner hasn't doubled. I will bid three spades. What? That's not a real bid. Partner, what did they think redouble showed? Oh, they think I'm inviting. Hmm. I mean, maybe this makes. We have a club loser, a spade loser, and we have a diamond loser. Oh, we're in great shape. Well done, partner. You did it. Hmm. My hands face up. I assume that a diamond to the king is going to work. Oh, it's just jack 10 third of hearts. Well, that makes things easy. Diamond to the king would have worked. 420. Excellent. Excellent auction by my partner over there. How is it possible that partner with four card spade support just passes over three clubs? King, queen, jack fourth. Nope. Gotta defend three clubs with that hand. I mean, what? We only have a nine card spade fit. All right, one diamond by partner over there. We will bid a spade. Partner bids a no trump. I think I can bid two hearts, non forcing. So I will do that. Diamond lead, obviously. Not the greatest. I wonder if we should try and cross rough or Jack of Diamonds is a really weird, I guess diamonds really are 7-2. East never took a call. I mean, East could have bid two diamonds over a no trump natural, but East didn't. So that probably means West has almost everything else, but that would give West like an opening hand. 
King, Queen of Hearts, Ace, Queen of Spades, Jack of Diamonds. Hmm. Maybe I cover this and pitch a spade. East can't lead diamonds again profitably. So East will either have to play spades, which, I mean, unlikely to be great for me because I think West has spades, but um, at least it would start doing something productive. East could play clubs. I can win in dummy and play spades, or East can play trumps. I'm just not sure that roughing two diamonds in my hand is all that great. I mean, I could rough a diamond, club over, rough a diamond low, club over, rough a diamond with the nine of hearts. I'm a little worried that it, they're just going to pull trumps and East is going to run the diamonds if I try something like that, but maybe maybe that's a sensible line of play. I just want to use my club entries to lead spades up, though. That's my problem here. Hmm. I'm going to pitch a spade. Okay. <laughs> well, we got a diamond trick. Look at us go. <laughs> Wait. That feels good. Now what? I mean, I wonder if I should cash two clubs before leading a spade. I probably should, right? I don't know. Then they can get a club rough. This is a this is a bit of a mess of a hand. Problem is, if I lead a spade and like East happens to have the ace, then East will play another diamond throw, which is not great. And it kind of looks like East has... I don't know, something's really not adding up on this one. Diamonds are definitely 7-2. <laughs> East has seven of them. But East never took a call. So like, how could they possibly have the Ace of Diamond, or the Ace of Spades? That would give them a 10 count with a seven card diamond suit. I don't think they would have passed throughout with that hand. Maybe none of this makes sense. Maybe East should just always bid with seven diamonds. Ace, queen, nine, eight, seven, seventh over a diamond. Wouldn't most people bid three diamonds with that? Probably. Hmm. I'm just going to lay a spade. I really don't understand. OK, well, so it looks like spades are 4-2, at least I suspect. Um, West starting with queen jack fourth, east having ace doubleton. Diamonds we know are 7-2. We don't know about the club position. Hmm. 
What? <laughs> Excuse me? I'm sorry. East has a singleton club too. So East started with three hearts. It looks like East started with king, queen, third of hearts, in fact. Because West didn't overrough the nine here. So both East and West are down to two hearts. East has king, queen, doubleton, and West has, like, five, two doubleton left or something like that. So if I just play a club and East roughs with the queen of hearts and returns a diamond, I have the rest. I can rough, play ace of hearts, dropping the king, and then my club's good. Yep. Plus 110. We did it. <laughs> way, way to go. How did East never bid in this auction? No one knows. <laughs> hey, PJF. How's it going? That kind of feels like a good result, doesn't it? <laughs> I don't think I could have done better. I have no idea. This was, this was a very complicated hand to play. Jack of Diamonds lead. Yeah, honestly, not sure. I wonder what Gibbs says. Apparently, I could have made an overtrack. Oh, well, because East has all the missing high cards, if I just cover with the King of Diamonds and rough, West never gets back in to play another diamond throw. <laughs> okay, fair enough. That was not on my radar once I knew diamonds were 7-2, but I, I guess that makes sense. Partner opens art. I will bid a spade. Three diamonds. Woo. I bet you three hearts shows a fit. Three hearts doesn't show a fit. What does three spades show? Five spades. Okay, I like three spades then. Partner bids three now. So, I know the robots don't jump shift with real hands. I guess I'm tempted to pass this. My hand's probably a little bit light. Like, if this queen of clubs was the queen of hearts, I would definitely be thinking about slam. But with, um, with the wasted queen of clubs and kind of a minimum hand, no fit, I guess we'll just... Play it in three now. Partner has a tw partner has a two no opener. Cool. Ten of spades lead. Well, that's a doubleton or singleton. Okay. I mean, presumably, I should win the king. So that West, if they did start with Queen Jack fifth, can't just, like, if I win the Ace of Spades, West could get in and lead a low spade back, setting up a few tricks. And then it probably makes sense to go after the heart suit. Do I need to take a diamond finesse first? Uh, like, I'm very tempted to play a diamond to the 10. And I wonder if I need to do that early or not. Things can get a little bit dicey if this is 10 doubleton of spades, because if East ever gets in again and ret returns another low spade, I'm going to be in this like precarious spot where if I duck the trick, West scores a spade, and my ace of spades might get stranded. But if I win the trick, then West will have two spade tricks set up. I guess I'm tempted to play a diamond to the 10 immediately then. If it loses, West will not be able to profitably play spades. So I think that's good for me. 
five of spades at trick one. Both the four and two are missing. But West is just encouraging with their high spot. Long tank. <laughs> Not good news. All right, switches to clubs. So we can play low. This has set up a couple of tricks, although like a bunch of things are blocked. Okay, diamond comes back. So we can win this, unblock the can of clubs, duck a heart, I suppose. Club to the king, low heart. Is there some sort of squeeze that I could be missing? Uh, yeah, West could get squeezed in the majors if West started with 4-4. Four, four, like, 2-3 or 4-4-3-2 four, four, shape with um, the jack third of clubs or jack double ton of clubs. But if I play for it and the club jack doesn't come home, then I don't pick up on um, three three hearts. So I think I'm just going to duck a heart. Looks like the hearts have not split the way we wanted. And he still has the jack of clubs remaining. Tough. Nine tricks. I don't know if we could do better. I mean, I obviously could if I pick up the jack of diamonds, but I mean, knowing that spades are like 5-1 or 4-2 makes it more likely that East has the diamond jack. Who knows why East didn't just lead a club at trick one? That seems like a pretty normal lead from a five card suit. One heart by East, we'll pass. You played a bean cup challenge, you bid to six no, Gib led a low heart through your king third opposite jack third. Yeah, um, it's kind of interesting, like under leading an ace against six no trump, especially if it's known that a lot of the strength is in dummy, isn't such a crazy thing to do, but it is unfortunate that they put you to that guess very early on. Club? 10, queen, five. Okay. I know what's happening in the club suit. Two of diamonds, discouraging. Seven of spades, encouraging. Okay. <laughs> nice spades, partner. Nice spades. So, partner started with what looks like five spades. So Declare has five hearts, three spades. Diamonds are going away if we don't cash the diamond ace. All right. Looks like that is the end of the play. Nice hand, pard. You never thought of taking a call. King, queen, jack, ten, fifth of spades. I mean, I don't know when partner is supposed to take a call, but do we have a good save in four spades? We lose a heart, two clubs, two diamonds at least. It's close. It's close. A club, double.
I guess I'll bit a spade. If we have a spade fit, the opponents might have hearts, so I want to compete in spades. Uh, two clubs to play, hopefully. King of hearts lead. All right. We have escaped from a no trump. That's good news. The opponents do have a heart fit. They missed it somehow after this auction. How is that possible? I guess West wasn't convinced their partner had hearts. Because East just had the hand that was a little bit too strong to overcall no trump. King of hearts lead. So I have a heart loser, a spade loser, a diamond, and two clubs at the very least. All right, let's play low at trick one. <laughs> I don't think this is the right defense from the opponents. I mean, maybe it is. Uh, I'm a little bit concerned about what's going on now. It looks like hearts are 4-4. Otherwise, I would have expected West to bid, but m maybe West wouldn't bid with five card hearts in this auction. It, it seems pretty likely they would, but... So if hearts are 4-4 and East has how many spades? <laughs> One? They very well might have five diamonds. I guess there's just not much I can do about it if they're getting roughs. We'll win the diamond ace and lead another club. All right, we did it. Made three. It was Jack double ten of spades. East didn't even void themselves in spades to try and get the rough. They they switched to the Jack of Spades. And then they never continued another spade. What what? Wasn't the whole plan by switching to the Jack of Spades to void yourself in spades, then get in with the club ace? And then, like, try and get to your partner's hand for the spade drop? <laughs> I guess not. Plus 110, we'll take it. It's been Michaels. Well, this auction got out of hand. Three spades. Four hearts by partner. Four spades by East. I don't think that I should be the one to bid. I mean, I really don't have more than I've promised. Like, my hearts are really bad. My side suit is really bad. I do have a spade void, so, like, that's nice. But we could just be going for 500. Like, I don't know what partner's bidding on. If I bid, I'll show 25 plus. Nope, nine or more points. That's it. Nothing nothing fancy. Just, just nine points bidding to the five level. Um, I'm a little worried with this partner that they're not going to do the right thing when four spades comes back around to them. Like, one of the things that's concerning here from a human perspective is, like, a human north might bid four hearts thinking that the momentum will push the opponents into four spades and they can be ready with a double, right? Like, partner's the one who's sitting over there with, like, queen jack ten fourth of spades and knows that the opponents are in trouble if they compete. So if partner has like jack fourth of hearts, queen jack ten fourth of spades, and like an outside card or something, um, <clears throat> then human partner would maybe make this four heart call and plan on doubling four spades. So it's a little bit more risky with that partner um, bidding five hearts directly. 
Yeah, worried that Gib won't do the right thing is a bit of an understatement. That's true. All right, fine. Five hearts it is. I've talked myself into it. I mean, this is probably percentage, given that I think it's unlikely partner's going to double with the right hand. Okay, great. Happy. Five spades. We're, we're done. Partner didn't even double this. Uh, here we go. So, I mean, presumably I lead a heart, because what else? 10 to king? 10 to king? What was that? What was the king? Oh, no, partner. What was the king of hearts? Whew. So he started with Seven spades? One heart? They have five cards in the minors? I guess I'll pitch a diamond? Partner six of diamonds. I wonder what that <laughs> signal is. Do we think it's high from six four doubleton? Actually, I don't remember what diamond East led. Did East lead the four of diamonds? Partner probably has three diamonds. I guess it's always safe to exit a club though. All right, down one. Good defense part. You did it. Plus 50. How are we doing in five hearts? We have a heart loser, a diamond, a club. We're down at least one. Probably exactly one. Pass, pass. Okay. Cool. We're in third seat. We're favorable. In all honesty, I think I would pass this in real life. Um, in the robot game, I don't know. Th this doesn't feel like a hand where I would want to do something weird in third seat. Like, one spade doesn't... I don't like one spade. I really hate two spades. Opening a club doesn't do what I want. You know, maybe if I had ace, queen, third of clubs and jack, ten, third of hearts, I would open a club. Probably not crazy. How bad could it be to open a spade? I mean, what's going to go wrong? <laughs> that, <laughs> well, instantly punished. <laughs> oh, no. Here we are. Oh, um, well, it's, it's probably not the worst contract I've been in today. <laughs> so we have some issues. Is it a well-known problem? that when neither you nor your partner have values, that you just don't have entries to either hand? Because it's starting to kind of feel like this is just like a well-known issue that might have been explored before. I would really like to lead diamonds up towards that queen 10 sixth, but I really don't know how. I guess I need to rough the opening lead, but Man, I, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do next. Maybe if I put West on lead, they'll switch too hard away from the king.
Okay. Cool. Let's play another diamond. King. Unlucky. All right. Now what? If West has the singleton king of spades, we actually make with an overtrick. Wait. No, my diamonds aren't set up. Never mind. Hold on. It's like nowhere close to making with an overtrick. <laughs> but wait a second. If West has the singleton jack of spades, do I make this from here? So we go... Spade to the ace, diamond rough, bringing the suit in. Club rough, diamond. If east doesn't rough the diamond, I can pitch a heart and play another diamond. So east has to rough the diamond, but if they rough with the king of spades, I pitch my heart loser. And then when they play back a trump, dummies eight. So I think I make if West has the singleton king or jack of spades. And I guess I'm down otherwise. What if I rough a club first? Rough a club, ace of spades, rough a diamond, rough a club, play a diamond, pitching a heart. No, East Ruffs and Small. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm, I'm down one if I take that line of play. But if, but if West has the Singleton Jack or King of Spades, I make it. What was the line of play again? Spade Ruff, Diamond Ruff, Club Ruff, Diamond. Yeah, or not Spade Ruff, Spade to the Ace. No! No! Unlucky. No, no, oh, uh, all right, down one. It was close. Singleton spade honor, we would have done it. Is it a good save? The opponents are cold for five clubs. Probably four hearts as well. Probably a good save. All right, board 10. Pass, pass, a diamond, pass, pass. Well. You don't see how Stiff Jack would do it? Imagine we got to this exact end position, but East didn't have the Jack of Spades. Instead, they had the seven. So the defense that East came up with would not have worked, right? East roughed with the King of Spades, but now not having the Jack, our Nine of Spades is an entry to the Good Diamonds and pulls the last trump. Um, and if they rough low, I can over rough, rough a club, and then play another diamond pitching a heart. Yep. Would have all worked. A diamond pass pass. I mean, I'm bidding something. I'm honestly wondering if it's right to double because partner's likely to have diamonds on this auction. Like if partner has a hand and so we could penalize them. Because I think it's pretty unlikely we're making a game our way. So like if I double and it goes pass, 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 that feels pretty good. Um, I don't have to be all that worried about, like, double and partner bids, like, 
clubs and then I correct to spades or hearts or whatever because I'm a passed hand. This wouldn't be the same if I was an unpassed hand, but here, if I double and then bid two spades later or something, partners should know that I have long spades. I mean, we could miss a spade fit. That's kind of the issue with doubling. But I think it protects our biggest plus, which is plus 200. <laughs> um, okay, hold on a second. Because is this natural? <laughs> I, I'm very worried that partner thinks two diamonds is natural. But partner, there was something else you could have done if you had natural diamonds on this auction, and it would not have been to be bidding diamonds on your own. I guess I'm going to bid two spades. <laughs> what? <laughs> now West bids three clubs. <laughs> West is like, I don't have enough to bid at the two level. But now that the opponents have cubid and bid their own suit, it's time to come back in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Could we not have just doubled three clubs and collected a massive penalty? I guess not. <laughs> All right, here we are. We're in three spades. So I have a diamond, a heart, probably two club losers. Maybe I can end play West somehow into doing something for me. Let's play the Ace to begin with. Um, I guess I am going to try and end play West. Like, we could just exit a heart and rough two hearts and hope that the spades come home. I just don't want West to exit trumps. Like, if, if I play a heart now and West plays a, a spade. I have no idea why West didn't lead a diamond. I mean, I guess the diamond honors are split. They have to be, right? Probably. I mean, maybe West would have led the king of hearts from king, queen, jack. Third. It's possible. Like, if spades are 2-2 two, two, and I go ace of spades, spade to the king, heart, and west wins, and west has every... No, the diamond honors are probably split. Okay, maybe this whole end play idea isn't going to work out. So in that case, I probably should play back a heart. Okay. Jack of hearts is weird. To a diamond switch to the king. Yeah, there's the spade exit that I was hoping wouldn't come, but is understandable. Really looks like a singleton. I mean, West has to have the queen of hearts remaining, and they really must be like 5-4-3-1 for this three-club bid. I mean, I know they say four or more diamonds, but... Guys, come on. There's no way, right? So let's play low. We'll win the king. Rough a heart. Rough a diamond. Cash the nine of hearts to pitch a club. Eventually rough a club and dummy. What? Oh. <laughs> okay. 
Yeah. <laughs> that, uh... That's unexpected. <laughs> I think I'm just down now. West started with King, Queen, Jack, Fourth of Hearts. I guess West was like four by one, singleton spade. <laughs> Three clubs. <laughs> Amazing. I don't think there's anything I can do. I still have two clubs and a spade to lose. And there's just no, like, club holding of any kind that I can pick up. Well... All right, down one. Why were we in three spades, by the way? Was there any way that we could have just like ended up in three clubs doubled? Was that possible? Maybe. I guess that was just impossible. No way to get there. 18. I guess I will reverse. I guess I'm not going to reverse. So I will bid four hearts. Feels okay. Feels like almost an underbid, but we'll do it. Ace of spades lead. Okay. Diamond switch. Just in case. All right. So, have I gotten myself into trouble because I dumped that Jack of Diamonds? Eh, maybe. Low Diamond Rough, Club to the Queen. All right, we're good. 11 tricks, no problem. Probably shouldn't have dumped the Jack of Diamonds. That was just silly. A club, or a diamond, two clubs, game forcing. I have a good hand, but... I mean, I could double. This doesn't feel like the right colors to do it. We'll just pass. Let's let them have their fun. Two no, three spades. Okay, we might get our heart lead. Or partner might lead a club or something. You never know. Three spades, four spades. This is a 4-3 fit, right? <laughs> this is always a 4-3 fit. I don't know why they say four spades shows four. Two no trump should deny a four card spade suit. <laughs> Hold on a second. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is a 4-3 fit. I don't really know what to lead. I mean, maybe I just cash my two aces. Is that crazy? Like, ace of hearts, look at dummy, and if I don't see anything interesting, I cash the diamond ace and just exit. Not really the team defense that you want to hear about, but at match points, it might be right. 
I'm a little worried West might have like the King, Queen, Third of Hearts and pitch East Diamonds if I don't take the Diamond Ace. All right. Well, there's the king, queen, third of hearts. How do they have king, queen, ten, nine, fourth? How do they have four spades? There's no way they have four spades in this auction. This is crazy. All right. Do I need to count tricks? Because if I play a heart and declare a pitches two diamonds on the hearts. <laughs> Reversing by opener. Yeah, of course. Reversing by opener shows five spades. You could be onto something. A lot of it depends on East clubs, but so East has the ace of spades, right? We're pretty sure. East is game forced. Let's say East's hand is just the ace of spades and ace, king, queen, sixth of clubs. I mean, obviously we could beat the contract at least one trick immediately by going ace king of diamonds club rough but do we still beat the contract even if i play a hard and they pitch two diamond losers like what's declare going to do next they're going to try and pull trumps right because they're hoping that spades and clubs split which we know they don't so they'll go king of spades we don't know which other honor they'll cash but let's say they get it right and play a spade to the ace They'll then play a spade to the 10, queen of spades, pull all the trumps, and then test the club suit. And that's not going to split. So they'll end up scoring two hearts, four spades, and three clubs is down one. And obviously, if the clubs are weaker and Declare has the Diamond King, then I would very much prefer not to cash the Diamond Ace right now. Huh. Well, I don't know. This all depends on how good East clubs are, and we have no idea on this type of auction. I'm going to continue hearts. Diamond pitch? No, they, can, they followed. Whoa. And then they play a club. Interesting. So club to the ace, we probably rough. So it looks like Declare is trying to set up clubs first. They must have like ace, king, sixth of clubs, right? To be playing the hand this way. I don't think East has three hearts. I think East has a doubleton. It's still very interesting, though, that East didn't play a heart pitching a diamond if they have six clubs. Yeah, they could be 4207. That's possible. Could they be 4225? Like in, in even lesser shape? Partners 5 of clubs is not really helpful to us in figuring out what's going on in the club suit. We play standard carding. Like 4225 makes sense, right? East has King Doubleton of Diamonds, so pitching on the Queen of Hearts doesn't help them at all. I think I'm tempted to rough this and just return another heart. I 
doesn't look like my ace of diamonds is going away. Switching to trumps isn't really going to help my cause, I don't think. The only downside of playing back a heart is we give Declare an extra entry to play clubs up again, but I guess it's fine. All right, there's a diamond pitch. King of spades. Queen of spades. Club to the king. I mean, I assume I should rough this and just cash the diamond ace. What? <laughs> Hello? Excuse me. Declare, you could have pitched your diamond loser on the third heart earlier. Why did you... What? All right. Down one. We beat him. Well played. Why didn't they pitch the diamond loser on, on the heart before playing a club? I guess it didn't matter. Had I cashed the ace of diamonds, would we have gotten an extra trick? I don't think so. But maybe? Not sure. I don't think so. All right, four boards to go. On to board 13. Pass, pass. We have 15. Barely. Capaletti, single suited. I played Capaletti in Gatlinburg. I think it came up once. Well, I, I think overcalling the opponent's no trump came up once, I guess I should say. Uh, okay. What is this? Partner has four hearts, west has diamonds, east has spades and diamonds. I don't think we should bid. My hand is terrible. Partner really shouldn't have five hearts. They should have transferred with five. So we only have an eight card fit. We're vulnerable. This is just not our hand. Ugh. They're playing in two spades. I don't like that. West has diamonds. I guess I'm gonna lead the ace of hearts. Gross. Oh boy. A good partner would give me kind of obvious shift as the signal. Very important to know if we can cash three clubs right now. I think the answer is no, given that I know nothing about partner's hand. East must have values for bidding spades. Like it's true, East could have ace, queen, jack, fifth of spades and the queen of clubs and that's their values, but I think that's a lot less likely than a club switch just blowing a trick. Isn't partner supposed to va have values? No, I don't think so. Six of clubs discard. Ten of clubs? I'm sorry. Mm. <laughs> so East has two diamonds and three hearts. We know that. East has to have the club king. Okay. I think what's going on is East started with...
5323. I think he started with 5323 three shape. So we should exit a spade. Eventually score a jack of clubs and king of spades. What? Partner? You can't play the ten of clubs with the king there. No. Uh, why? Wow, East was 4-4 four, four in the black suits. Man, this was, this was horrible defense. Partner really needed to fly the king of clubs to put a spade through to take us off of the end play. And I guess it didn't matter at the end, but small club at trick two. <laughs> Wouldn't have been great. I mean, maybe if we play club to the king and partner switches to spades, but that seems pretty unlikely. Well, plus 100, we got a plus score. Pass by East. We have 10, I will pass. A diamond, two clubs. You don't think it's that uncommon for East to have four spades? I mean, they definitely shouldn't in their explanation. It says four or more spades. <laughs> the, the, the bots do not insert bridge convention well. That's also true. All right, this two club overcall. Like, this is a hand where I might want to bid three no with a human partner, and with the robot, I might pass. <laughs> I guess I can compromise, right? I can bid two no. I guess I'll bid three now. Diamond lead. Well, partner did show their hand. I mean, presumably we would rather play in four spades on this one, but diamond lead, we have a diamond trick. We have probably six clubs in the Ace of Hearts. We just need to score a spade. I think I'm going to preserve that 10 of hearts and dummy until I need to let it go on a diamond or until I have the spade set up. Like, I could definitely pitch a heart here, win, play west for the spade queen, and try and take, like, 11 or 12 tricks, but I think it's fine to do things this way. Queen of, queen of diamonds is an interesting card. Um, wow, if I knew East had the Diamond Queen, I might have wanted to pitch a club instead. All right, let's try the Jack of Spades. So, I mean, West could not have the spade queen. I think it's pretty likely that he does, though. I guess I'm going to pitch a club. And then pitch another club on the next diamond and try the spade finesse. And if that wins... I don't know. I have some decisions to make, I guess. Because if the clubs don't run, I don't just want to, like, cash my last diamond pitching hard and hope that the clubs work out.
Okay, that's a lot of diamonds from West. West has seven diamonds. <clears throat> Two spades. There's a club pitch from East. Huh. So West has turned up with a diamond ace, ace, queen of spades. We have to decide if we're playing a club to the nine. Well, I could cash the ace of hearts to get a little bit more info, but I don't think it's going to help all that much. I mean, certainly if West dumps the king of hearts, then that will help. <laughs> but if West just follows with a low heart, I won't know if West is 7-2-2-2 two, 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 or has a singleton heart and East just never bid. I think Singleton Heart is pretty unlikely for West, though. East might have made a negative double with King Jack Sixth. I mean, East might have opened with King Jack Sixth. Like, I could definitely cash the ace and see if the King or Jack pops. Unfortunately, I guess I can't do that and then play a club to the nine, can I? Okay, so may maybe this is maybe this is a fruitless <laughs> line of reasoning. I, I just have to decide if I'm playing a club to the nine or not. East club pitch would have had to have been from a five card suit here, but East might pitch from a five card club suit, it's possible. I'm just going to play club to the king. All right. Great. <laughs> Good. I did. West had the jack doubleton. 460. Feels like an okay result. I mean, it looks like spades can only make 11 tricks. So playing in no trump was worth a lot. Two boards to go. Pass, pass, pass. Two clubs. Three clubs, positive, three no trump. I like how three no just isn't forcing, despite getting a positive response to their strong two bid. They're just like, well, we only have a good suit, and we only have 32 highs, but probably not worth exploring past three no. Like, against six now, I might lead a low spade. I'm very tempted to lead a low spade anyway. Hoping to score two tricks on defense. All right, let's do it. <laughs> no more clubs east. <laughs> okay. Oh, this kind of looks disappointing, doesn't it? I guess we better cash the diamond ace before that goes away. All right, I'm good here. We tried our best. 
The opponents had a spade fit. Minus 460. Well, last hand, a diamond by east. I guess I will bid a heart. Three hearts. Weak. East makes a takeout double. Um, gross. We can't really count on partner for defense. Yeah, the idea of redouble would be that we might want to penalize them if they get to like three spades or four of a minor. <laughs> no one no trump over one diamond? Probably not with a six card major. But again, robot games, anything can work. I... I don't know why, but I'm kind of drawn towards four hearts with the extra trump. I don't think I'm making it. I mean, we could. It's possible that we could make it if partner has like a singleton spade, but I think it's pretty unlikely. It just might be a good save against whatever the opponents are gonna end up in. And if they bid over four hearts, maybe I'll double. I know partner's bid technically shows something, five to seven. I don't like five hearts. Like, I don't think four hearts was making, and the opponents might just be going down in this. But how confident am I that they're going down? Confident enough to double? I think I'm happy to have pushed them up a level. It's kind of not the same as them playing in three spades, because if they make this, this is a game bonus. But. I think they're likely enough to go down that I'm willing to pass this out. Like, partner's pass could indicate some defense as well over four spades. My jack of spades might be a trick. Ten of clubs lead. Well, this isn't really the dummy that we were hoping for. King of Hearts. Let's give partner a club rough. Okay, this went great. So we have beaten them a trick. Now what? <laughs> I guess I return a trump. Uh oh, they they just they just have the rest. All the clubs run to pitch the diamonds even if Declara didn't have a doubleton in hand. Plus 100, we'll take it. How did we do today? I don't know. First board didn't start out great. We had a 58. 13% on board one for getting to the correct game, mind you, and then running into the horrible diamond split and the horrible diamond lead, which was unfortunate. Board five wasn't great. Board five, we played in three now, and just like everything was offside, basically. Well, the diamond hook didn't work. Hearts didn't split. Defense got all their tricks. I guess for players who didn't take the diamond hook at trick two, maybe the robots misdefended. Always try and give your opponents an opportunity to misdefend. Our best boards were board 12. We bit, beat four spades a trick. What? <laughs> Wait, huh. hold on, hold on a second. We never took a call in the auction. How did we score 92% on this board? Did a lot of, wait a second. I, I, need, to, I need to take a quick look at this. If we had gone ace of hearts, ace of diamonds, what would happen? Ace of diamonds, jack of diamonds, rough.
I guess declare crosses and hearts to rough another diamond. I mean, they can make it from here if they play Ace of Spades Spade Hook. Actually, the hand gets very interesting. If they lead the ace of clubs, we rough. What can I do? If I return a trump, they win the ace, pull trumps, and cash all their major suit cards, and north gets squeezed in the minors. If I return a diamond, declare... Well, Declare still has to work out to hook me for the Jack of Spades. Which they might do. I mean, this this is a situation where if I return a diamond, Declare has to rough with the Spade Ace and has to lead a Spade up, and now they have to guess what to do. If they hook the Ten of Spades, they make it. Huh. So why was it that on our line of play, Declare didn't adopt this plan? I mean, it looks very natural to me to pull two rounds of trumps immediately and then play ace king of clubs. But that line of play was going to go very poorly. So Gib did a little bit better than that plan. I think that's like the human plan, right? If spades are 3-2 and clubs are 3-2, you just have the rest from this point. You pull two, three rounds of trumps, ace king of clubs, club rough, all the clubs are good. Heart pitching a diamond, rough back to hand, and your hand's high. So... Gib kind of did better than that by playing a club at trick two to the ace and eventually ended up down one. Hmm. I'm not sure, but we scored very well on that one. Five spades down one on board eight was also a good score. Man, just defending and beating the opponents a trick happens to be great. Who would have thought that taking all of your tricks on defense is not as easy as it seems?